North Shore football team dealing with a heavy loss. Teammates gathering this afternoon to share kind words about Jarvon Coles. The 18 year old who had plans to play college football was shot and killed at a house party in Humble this weekend. Our Troy Kless was the only reporter with Jarvon's friends and teammates today. He's live at North Shore High School tonight. Troy. Yeah, thank you, Ron. Well, many friends describe Jarvon, who has also had the nickname VZ, like a brother to them. Now, many friends and adults are missing him tonight, and they're also hoping for leads in the sheriff's office investigation. His memory cannot be hidden. Yes, no, no, in a tragedy, these North Shore football teammates are together remembering their friend, 18-year-old Jarvon Coles. He really was the face of the East Side. He really bringing us all together right now. Darren Scales is one of many with positive memories, several of his teammates wanting to say something about Jarvon. He was like a brother to me, like, he supported me in like every single way, like, you can imagine, like. That he was just like a ball of joy. Anywhere you go, you don't, he don't even have to be smiling, you just see, feel his presence. He love to make jokes. <sighs> he was one of the smartest people I knew. Jarvon, he just. He brought, he brought the best out of anybody he was around. And like, he always had positive, upgoing energy. His teammates are missing that energy right now. After Coles was killed at a house party in Humble late Saturday night, one of the 911 calls was for a seizure as friends were trying to get him help. North Shore parents demanding the shooter turn himself in. Let us know that you are better than what you just did. You shot a young man for no reason that you don't even know. You didn't have to do that. The Harris County Sheriff's Office says a vehicle drove by and fired shots from the next block. Oh, God, Jesus. people say yeah. amen. As teammates are coping with the tragedy, they want to honor someone they call a brother. Make sure they save him a seat in graduation because he was smart. He's top 10% of the school. Top 10% of the school. He was one of the best on that football field, man. A friend told us there that the shooting had the shooter had nothing to do with the people that were inside the party and they say that it was calm until those shots were fired. Now the Harris County Sheriff's Office also tells us that they did invest interview several witnesses that were at the scene that night, but anyone with information is asked to call investigators. Reporting live from North Shore tonight, Troy Kless, KHOU 11 News. Beyond heartbreaking. Troy, thank you so much.